What is up, everybody? <clears throat> we are headed to Tri-City Speedway this weekend. Um, this is Tuesday the 19th, I believe. I'm taking this one. We're taking Dad's new car. It just got some um, fresh vinyl put on it and some new panels, so... It looks great. Um, everything's backwards for you guys because I don't have my camera flipped around. I'm sorry about that. We got some new vinyl on the nose too. Um, and then I believe we've got a new sticker up top on the roof. So that's good. Um, I believe his car is ready to go for the most part. I think we both have to do some tires. We're gonna get some tires when we get there and we're gonna mount them um, and grind them and all that good stuff when we get there. As far as little things go, my car still needs a little, a few little things. Um, like the spoiler, it needs cleaned. Poplar Bluff, I had to wash my car twice and it still has dirt on it. And it's just the kind of like kinetic sand dirt that they have. Um, but I'm still trying to clean all of it off. So, um, we're going to get these two cars ready to go. That one is going to sit there for just a little bit, um, a few weeks probably, or a week or so, week or two, um, until it gets fully gone through and fixed. If you guys watched our last video, you would know that we took it to, or dad raced it at Paducah and he actually broke the power steering belt, but we ended up getting it fixed. So, make sure you guys go watch that last video. We're still getting over sickness, and it's lingering, um, so hopefully it's gone by this weekend. But that's all I'm going to video for now. I might video a little bit going up to Tri-City at the end of this week um, on Thursday morning or Wednesday night for me maybe tomorrow. So, we will pick the camera back up tomorrow. I guess just rolled out of bed because I did. That trailer is all loaded up. This trailer and that trailer, we've got a few things to put in the RV. Um, and we're dealing with somehow the propane on the small grill was turned on. So I walked in there with a, or you could smell full on propane, but this car is loaded. Um, when we get to the track today, we've got some tire work to do. Um, other than that, it looks like it rained last night pretty good bit. So everything's a little bit more clean on the trailer than it was because it was still dirty from Poplar Bluff. Um, there's just so much dirt everywhere, but we are fixing to go in just a little bit, probably 45 minutes or so. Welcome to Tri-City, everybody. Um, we're trying to figure out what that is. Can you drive it from up top? Look, there's a steering wheel up there. It's like a bus of some sort with no top. Gotta grab something out of the trailer. <laughs> Are you having a party in here? <laughs> Eat ma'am. Yeah.
I passed tech so far. I got my little ticket or whatever. Um, the only thing they told me is I got to move my rear quarter panels in just a little bit. Dad's on his way, so we'll see if he passed and um, if he's got to change anything. They rained out after probably 15 minutes, I would say. Um, Dad's car, if you see the video and you have a video of it, he spun out in hot lap. Um, the car actually died, so we couldn't figure out what was wrong with it. He had to be push started, um, I think. And then, anyways, we thought it was maybe the starter, brand new starter, so we were like, well, that sucks if it is. It ended up being the battery they figured out this morning. So they're going to put a, go to town, get a new battery, put a new battery in it. Um, we're going to just do general maintenance on mine. We didn't even obviously really run it other than hot laps. So not anything too crazy. Just wipe it down, stuff like that. So make sure there's no mud in anything and do that to his as well. So that's the plan for now. I'm going to set you guys up on a time lapse. Um, today it's a full new day of racing since we didn't get anything in last night, qualifying or heat race wise. So, stay tuned and we will keep you updated throughout the night.
are we doing tonight? Hopefully we're racing. And hopefully we have no more no issues, issues with this. With starters or batteries or carburetors. Stuff. And no rain because this mud is ridiculous. Yep, we've got the cars mostly clean. These things, listen, I know they're not really made to clean race cars. Hey, they work perfect. But they work. So when you're in need of washing a race car at the track, you know, just and you don't you, got a bucket and water and some of these soap. paint grease and adhesive wipes. Night number two, rained out. So we're getting ice cream. 